not another force with a glaze. I cannot. I cannot. On the previous vlog with Peyton. I tell you, they spraying something in the air, y'all. Y'all cannot, y'all can't tell me they not spraying something in the air. Oh. Who tell it like shit don't hurt? Curl who smell it? That don't smell like baccarat. It smell like Ariana Grande cloud. Is it cold inside? Because it's 70 degrees outside. Is it cold inside of the unit right now? It's too cold for us, yeah. As you can see, it's a mood elevator. <laughs> Bitch, I'm going up. <laughs> Hell. I step outside, I need my pace. Take one down and hit my pace. This girl come in it says I'm gonna need you to give me the deets on these cheek fillers that you got. Why would I do this? This is the new back around for 2022. I'm not lying to you. Man was walking through the place with style and grace. Allow me to lace these lyrical dishes in your bushes. That's what you saying for? You the one took the initiative. Ain't nobody tell you to do that. What you saying for? That realistic day in my life was very eventful. If you haven't checked it out, please go and do so. And let's jump in to see what's going on in this next vlog. Your boy got the full body do rag out. Drop the roof and let you smoke it. I got diamonds to win since he's slides in both kids. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. And what about it? Anyway, though, welcome back to another weekly vlog. If you are a first time viewer, my name is Peyton. So I'm up at the PayPal's call me Pay Pay. Some call me P. It's whatever you want, but it's top tier over here. So all you have to do to become a PayPal is hit the subscribe button, turn your notifications on, and if you can, like every video. There are also ways to like the video even if you are watching on your TV. And if you need me to show you how to do that, I will because likes really help me. Also, sharing my videos help. And I love it when y'all comment because I like interacting with y'all. I hate texting. I was just telling a PayPal this last night when we went to dinner. I absolutely hate texting, but I love responding to comments. I be responding to y'all when I'm in the bathroom, when I'm on the toilet. I respond to y'all when I'm at dinner solo by myself. I respond to y'all when um, I, be, I might be laying next to y'all a friend. I respond to y'all when I'm out at the club and I'm at the bar by myself and I don't want to talk to nobody, so I be in my phone like this so they can leave me alone. I love talking to y'all. I absolutely love talking to y'all. But I hate texting. It's so weird. So, <clears throat> I don't know how to explain it, but I know PayPal's are top tier, okay? And I love y'all with all of my heart. So, yeah, subscribe and turn your notifications on if you want to. I mean, it's it's totally your choice because I know people are real picky about who they subscribe to. Real picky. I know. But anyway, today is going to be a pretty chill Monday for me. You know, Mondays is you getting back into the swing of things after your weekend and 
I got work to do actually. I need to edit a video. I need to film some sponsorship contents. I need to finish cleaning my house. I got clothes that I need to fold. Um, and um, I want to go to Home Goods in a couple of stores to find some more items for this guest bathroom because it's very minimal in there and I love it. I'm not gonna lie, I love it, but it needs towels and I don't know, I feel like it needs like some type of console table in there so I can set things on because it's really not a lot of places to set things on in that bathroom. And I'm not gonna lie, the cabinet over the toilet, I hate it, I really wanna take it down, but um, I don't know. And then it needs more lighting in there as well. So I need to call an electrician and see if they can hardwire some sconces or something, some type of lighting. Like I'm gonna go to Ikea and see if I can find some better bathroom lighting. So it can be like, lighting over the mirror because child, it's just not doing it for me the lighting in there is just not doing it for me it's so dim and it's sexy but it needs more lighting it does but i don't be in a company like this so it's not like the biggest priority but um yeah oh i did order some stuff from shein i need to open that i order some cute stuff from shein but yeah i'm about to make me a bowl of cereal and get to work on this video so it can go up later on today. Okay, I'm gonna tell y'all a little trick how to wrap y'all her up and the bunny don't come off. Put on three bunnets. One, two, three. You heard it here first. It's still straight, ain't got no look. Kink like kink kink. Y'all, I'm still eating this Hello Fresh. It's good. What was that called? I'm, I'm really gonna have to like, I'm keeping that recipe. I keep all my HelloFresh recipes. Do y'all keep y'all recipes? I keep them just in case Um, I wanna make it again myself and like just order groceries. I keep the recipes. But the recipe that I just made the other day in my video, that was my first time having that recipe in Oh my God, it's so good. I probably probably would trade the pork for turkey sausage and try it with turkey sausage the next time just because I don't have anything against pork. I ain't got nothing against the pig. I really don't. Um, But for me and my blood pressure, how my blood pressure set up and how it work, I have to be careful eating the pig, child. I have to be real careful eating the pig. Cause the pig gave me a headache and, and run my blood pressure up. But it's so good. But I don't eat all parts of the pig. I do not eat all parts of the pig. I do not, I don't eat chitterlings. I don't eat chitterlings. I don't like pork hot dogs. They make me sick to my stomach. I got I got enough for one more bowl. Come on, meal prep. Shit. This might, that microwave gonna cook it all the way through. Y'all know how when you microwave stuff and you get to the very middle and it's still cold? Ooh, that make me some kind of mad. I can't stand it. But this right here, what kind of microwave is this? A whirlpool. That microwave, that's a good microwave. You put it on two minutes, it's gonna heat it all the way through. I be so proud of my little microwave. I be so proud. But yeah, I just finished editing a video, y'all. That's going up today. So y'all got three videos back to back. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Do you love me? Do you? And you know what? You're gonna get another video tomorrow. We're gonna do a fragrance video tomorrow. So... This vlog gonna go up, let's see, today, Monday. Tomorrow. We'll try. This vlog might go up Friday. Give me a chance to like have some content cause when I'm working, I'm not really filming content cause I'm working. So 
give me a little chance to film some content this vlog might go up friday because we're gonna do a fragrance video and update y'all on the new 2022 scents of the year baby okay because honey let me tell you i be smelling so good and i got some i got some pressure i got some new pressure to tell y'all about oh these retainers are so tight ah hey y'all good morning i'm up bright and early i'm getting ready to go get a facial so this is what i'm wearing today i'm gonna throw on my um green bottega slides this mirror is so deceiving. This mirror, I, this what that's why I love this mirror. I would never get rid of this mirror. Because this mirror is going to make me, I, this is what I really look like. The other mirror downstairs made me look skinny. So I always tell people when they come over, don't look in this mirror. If you feeling like you want to lose weight, don't look in this mirror. Okay? This mirror was made especially for me. If you, the other mirror will make you look skinny. You know? So... This my mirror. Okay, today's scent is Santal Botanique by Mason Clebelli. Um, you guys know that I have a Papyrus Molecular by this brand as well. And um, I love it. I said that I was going to get Santal Botanique next. And my good friends over at Twisted Lily sent me this. They did offer me a coupon code, but I don't think that it will work on this house. But if you go on the site and you see anything else that you like, you can use the code Peyton10 for 10% off. So we about to see what this one do because we already know the other one. We got good reviews with the other one. That's my new favorite. I always, whenever y'all spray perfume on, especially if you have long hair, it really don't matter like the length of your hair, but I always spray it right here. Like don't spray it on your neck because it's, it's right under your nose. It'll make you nauseous. Spray it like behind your ear, like right here. So when people hug you or you get close to people, they can get a whiff of the skin scent and what it smells like after it's sat on the skin and mixed with their chemistry. Cause they ain't gonna really smell it on your wrist. Oh, it smells so good down here. So I'm about to slide these slides on. It's so bright in here in the daytime, you don't even need lighting. This is like the perfect place to do sit down and talk videos. So I'm gonna start doing some, get ready with me some makeup tutorials or something like that in here. I don't know. But yeah, today is just a chill little maintenance day. While I'm out, I'm gonna get Damn, will they let me walk in? Will I, will I be able to go eat anywhere with these slides on? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Seats. Seats still shining. Yeah, I'm, a, <clears throat> I'm definitely going to let them keep um, detailing my car. Once a month. I don't know what he put on my seats, but my seats, my seats look like they just put on baby oil, baby. They look real good. I love shiny leather seats. So yeah, we're about to go get a uh, hydro facial today. And what's today, Tuesday? Today is a perfect day to go to home goods because Everybody either at work or at home caring for their kids. All the all the stay at home moms, they probably somewhere doing. You know what? I'm actually like a little housewife. I'm married to the money. <laughs> Period. What about it? I am Paris. Nice to meet you. I know you fucking with a dick. Nothing do about anything. Please drop. Come inside me. I'm a kid. I want me to make you a scene. I've never been. Only get so much for the pregnant unless you're in a very high, high end area where people are gonna drop to the higher. 
poetry and two for one, girl. I'm high now, I wanna see the sun do it. The accent's easy in the sun dress. Your accent's leaking on my tongue. Yeah, she's back to the song, the same for my check. I made you come, you came right back. You're calling me up on a late night, like I got you leaking like a break pipe. Swimming in your seat, she's like a dive bomb. And it just creeping like a great white. I might fuck you in your own car. Grab my face, just like a porn star. Then it's so deep, she caught a broke shot. I just want one thing out the phone call. Oh boy, I love Miss Sally. Miss Sally is such a good esthetician. She's going to go above and beyond to make sure your skin looks amazing when you leave. She's not going to, you know how when you go to certain spas, it's like an assembly line, right? So they're only going to do what they're supposed to do. They're not going to do anything extra if you don't pay for it. So there's this one spa that I go to. Um, damn, I forgot what it's called. I haven't been in a while. But um, the fuck? Um, yeah they everything is a la carte so if you want extractions you got to pay for it like if, if you book a hydrofacial or something or like a, some type of facial with them if you want any them to do anything extra you have to pay for it miss sally is not going to do that miss sally is going to go above and beyond she's really going to assess your skin and say hey you know i see you got some spots i see you got some congestion i see you got this do you want me to do this as well it may cost a little extra but it's not going to be ridiculous you know it she does the extractions in like extractions are included in her hydrofacials and i usually go only to her for hydrofacials because she is so so thorough and good at it it's not her just like sweeping over your skin like she really tries to pull all of the congestion out of your pores um so i'm gonna be y'all are gonna be seeing miss sally a lot more y'all didn't see her like specifically in this video but that's the older black lady that i usually go to for my hydrofacials here one she actually uses the real hydrofacial md machine it's not a knockoff or off brand she actually uses the hydrofacial md machine and the hydrofacial products so you are getting top tier hydrofacial um treatment so i'm gonna start going to her more frequently just because um i feel like adding hydrofacials into my skincare routine as far as like facials and getting um chemical peels like every six to seven weeks or so is really going to help like lighten these dark spots because this area right here when i'm not wearing makeup and y'all know i don't wear makeup that often i only wear makeup when i go out um and it's like really outside and I like just running errands throughout the day because I can throw on some lashes and lip gloss and feel great and pretty but when I actually go out did I leave something hey hey I think your battery out of your camera you, it's on the bed oh, okay okay I'll come I'll come back okay. up and get it okay bye, okay, bye. Who is this asking me for my address? Oh. Oh, I got a massage today. So we gotta get back to the house. I know, I know, I know that you're drunk. Yeah. Tell me what you want after this club. Oh. You know I get nasty, you know I get nasty. Yo, Uber ride in my house, you call the taxi I'm picky with my women, I'm deciding Call me to your crib and I'm sliding I'm picky with my women, I'm deciding Call me to your crib and I'm sliding I'm a first things first, let me get that introduction And we all no longer road to sell destruction If you so in love, you ain't gonna tell me nothing this uh -huh. Cause I had no idea Before I got there too much Before I got there too much Let's get all y'all Yeah, I need all y'all Before I got there too much Let me get 
get that introduction. Okay, we didn't do much damage, but we did a little damage. Baby Zara got some fresh in there. Y'all better go check out Zara. Zara got some fresh in there. So I'm about to go to Grand Lux since I got a little time to spare before my massage because he's coming to my house. So, um, oh, and I get to use my massage oil candle that uh, Skin Potion sent me. Because this smells so good. And I've actually put the body butter on today. So, yeah. But I'm about to go in Grand Looks and give me some food. sleep on a table I'm still sleepy I really need to go on here and order my groceries cuz there's a storm coming I don't know when it's coming but supposedly it's a storm coming everybody's scared that it's gonna be like last year hopefully not that's not good but I do need to go ahead and Instacart my groceries because I'm not going to the grocery store. I'm gonna take me a quick little nap and Instacart them around about 5 or 5, 5 30. I'm sleepy. I've been taking on all this baggage. I'm missing some batteries. Oh, I feel like ordering some stuff off Amazon. But what? Hey. Hey, y'all. So, I just woke up from a nap not too long ago. So, um, I, I hope this storm isn't bad because I can't. I, I think I ordered enough food, though. I think I ordered a good week week and a half worth of food i'm definitely gonna have to start like cooking cooking though because supposedly this storm's supposed to be bad for the next two days so i'm hoping that it's not like last year because last year was pretty bad but um yeah obviously the grocery stores are kind of empty so mm-hmm mm-hmm but yeah, I got a video that I need to film and I do not feel like filming right now. So I'm probably gonna do it tomorrow. Send it them send it to them tomorrow. Y'all, I got some cute stuff at Zara. Baby Zara got some Zara got some heat. Y'all better go in Zara because Zara got some heat right now. I got a bad habit of like saving clothes for months, sometimes years before I wear them. And then when I finally wear them in a vlog, people are like, where did you get this from? And I'm like, it's old, it's, it's sold out now, like they don't have it. So as I shop, I'm trying to go ahead and wear the things that I buy so you all will be able to get them. And I don't usually do that. Like, I'm, I have a bad habit of shopping for the future. Like I'll buy something and like, oh, this this would be cute to go on like a vacation. And I might not have a, I might not even have a vacation booked yet. But yeah, girl. Um, I'm just sitting here waiting on ma'am to deliver my groceries so we can put them up. So a lot of people in the last, I have my aligners in by the way. That's why I have a little list. I'm on week five, and y'all, my teeth have moved so much i forgot to tell y'all about that um they saw right now like whenever i put my new aligner in for the first two or three days my teeth be real sensitive so i have to eat like soft foods for the first two or three days when i first put them in but 
my teeth have moved so much like the gap that I had down here it was wide like when I when I would floss it literally wasn't even snapping it's snapping now so bite really works I have one gap left to close that's not snapping and it's on this side and um anybody else probably would have been like so what but when it comes to your teeth they're supposed to be like this your teeth are supposed to touch so when you floss it's always supposed to snap out if it, it just if it goes in freely that means you got a, a food pocket and um it's not good like it's not good so that's why i did the bite aligners and i definitely can attest that bite aligners work seriously they work i'm on week five i have two more weeks to go and then i'll be done i'm still gonna wear my last one um just to make sure that my teeth are retained in the position because obviously when i don't wear them i i grind and i clench especially in my sleep and when i'm stressing and it causes my teeth to move and it also makes them super sensitive. So I think because I was clenching and grinding, that's what was causing the sensitivity. Like my nerves were just like running amok because it was just too much pressure on my teeth. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry. I'm, the table is shaking. Ah! And what about it? So anyway, if you said bless you, thank you. <laughs> thank you because try the way I scream, it do be feeling like a little spirit coming up out of me. Spirit! Do I need to say? I literally didn't get anything. Going through these bags. It's not very much. Okay, you guys, I'm getting ready to go to brunch with a friend. Mm -hmm. It's a day date. Mm -hmm. So I just got on lashes and lip gloss like I always do. This jacket is from Jerly Sheen. The jumpsuit is from um, Fashion Nova. I should have got a medium. And then I'm just wearing my Givenchy shark boots that I love so much. And we give him body, you know. It's a it's a look, but it's casual, you know. Ready for the world. <sighs> Y'all, it this jacket hot than a motherfucker. But it's it's cold outside, so and the weather gonna drop, so wow, I am sweating. Seven hours later. Child, not another forest wood flash. I cannot. I cannot. Okay. All right, you guys, I am back from my little lunch date. It was disturbingly enlightening to say the least. What about my retainers? I think I might've left them downstairs. On my my aligners I meant but yeah disturbingly enlightening and um I was, I was over there and I was over this house and we're kicking it and you know it's supposed to be um storm coming I've been saying this in the vlog the whole time yeah it's supposed to be storm coming tomorrow like it's supposed to be it's supposed to start snowing later on tonight, and um, this is the Batiste dry shampoo because my hair kind of oily. And as you can see, that bow hole, baby, it's been on since when? I don't want to pull it too hard, but um, I'm not ready to take it out. So I'm just about to put some dry shampoo on it and flat iron it and wrap it. But yeah, I'm over there kicking it with them and I just, I just have this urge to go home. I just, 
you know, if we're talking about being snowed in with somebody, I yeah, I'd rather just be snowed in by myself. And that's that probably says a lot without saying very much. But yeah, no. So yeah. Damn, I ain't even turning it on. Ugh. So yeah, I am about to derobe and take a shower and I was gonna film some content today but when I got that phone call and he wanted to go to lunch it kind of like changed my plans up so I'm like all right boom we'll just we'll just go to lunch and get with you but I wanted to come on home these flat irons heat up so fast yeah, I just I just wanted to come home after that. After, you know, just I don't know. Like I just hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't know. I just have those moments where like I'm in someone else's space and I just want to go home. It don't really have a lot to do with the person. I just like being at home. Hell, as much as I pay for my house, I should want to like being at home. I don't want to be in nobody else's face. And my grandma always taught me not to wear out your welcome, you know? I always find a good point and a good time to just leave and leave, go home. Because you want a person to miss you, you know what I'm saying? You want a person to just have the opportunity to miss you and and think about you but if you always over there and you stand over you stand longer than they planned on you staying like and like i said i don't even know if like this person thinks that way i'm pretty sure they don't but i just like being in my own home in my own space oh, i love these are so fucking much i cannot stress how much i love this hair it honestly is like the perfect color the perfect highlight job like it's perfect like ma'am just she know what she doing okay like i said this wig is from z monet one of the paypal sent it to me and i love it like when i say i'm i'm ripping her i'm ripping me i'm hard because y'all know i don't play about y'all yep y'all know that right y'all know i don't play about y'all so whenever you send me products i might not review them immediately when i get them but when i get them i go hard i go hard and just so y'all know a lot of times i'm not paid Almost all of the times I'm not paid. So this hair review is not sponsored in that way where ma'am paid me to say these things about her hair. No, this is how I really feel about sis hair. Like sis got some good damn hair. She makes some good wigs. So go support because I used to have a wig business and I know how it is to want to reach out to um influencers and get them to you know support and, and and rep your brand and things like that and people always want money and stuff like that like don't get me wrong this is a business for me and a lot of sponsorships i do i am paid to you know um talk about things in my in my videos but when if i say a paypal sent it to me and you don't hear me say it's sponsored then i'm doing it out of the kindness of my heart and because i really rock with the product i really rock with the paypal and me and this girl we've only spoke like i think briefly in my dms and she said that she was oh my god i'm starving she said that she was sending me a wig and she sent it a while ago like i said she sent it before i moved um and I I I didn't know like where it was because I had so much stuff and I 
like as soon as I get the pal down y'all the pal get right back big full of you know PR products that you all send me so she reached out again and I'm so glad she did and I was like girl let me go look in this closet and see if I can find it and I end up finding it putting it on loving it like I don't want to take this hair off like this hair looked like my hair it looked like a good old silk press I love this wig so definitely go on support and and check her out you guys if you are one of those people that like full wigs like a lot of hair you will love her wigs because I feel like it's a natural fool it's an, a believable fool um everybody that has complimented me on this wig has thought that this was my natural hair and I feel like that's a huge compliment because wigs nowadays be looking really wiggy especially when you do like overdo the baby hairs and stuff like that so sis got that pressure go support Your heart is hard to carry after dark Try to blame for what we could have been Cause look at what we are Your friends are scared to tell you you went too far Funny that it's always been all about you from the start I met someone new last night And we kicked it And I'm going back there tonight And you know what's on my mind this time Wisdom is like a baobab tree, no one individual can embrace it. Love is like a baby, it needs to be treated tenderly. A woman's polite devotion is her greatest beauty. friend is someone who knows the song in your heart and can sing it back to you when you have forgotten the words. Ooh. Out of body, that's just how I feel when I'm around you, shot it. Last night we didn't say it, but girl, we both thought it. Why second guess I should have stayed? Say the word, I'm on the way This feels like teenage fever I'm not scared of it, she ain't either Why second guess, I should've stayed But you know what's on my mind, so Ugh, that's terrible, it tastes like beer Jesus, what the wrong with people? I'm gonna put a little of this Simply Limeade in it. Hopefully that helps. Not really. all right so i have just finished filming my updated fragrance collection and i got a headache <sighs> of course i got a fucking headache and i got i'm hungry i got a hungry headache at that so it's a from smelling too many perfumes headache and a hungry headache Somebody outside was trying to drive on this snow. It did not sound good. So I'm about to make me some, a cup of noodles real quick. I was supposed to cook. I was supposed to cook, but I'm about to make me a cup of noodles. Cause I gotta edit this video and try to get it up tonight. I'm actually like 
past due deadline. Supposed to be up on the first. I'm probably gonna make some hot wings. And I got some canned, some canned collard greens. Okay. I hope this footage looks good. I hope. We need to upload these footages and I need to do some research on, I really could have did my fragrance video in here, but I wanted to do it in front of my bed because I didn't want to have to bring all of those fragrances downstairs and then take them back upstairs. It was only 20, but Still a lot. And intoxicating and the dry down on this is beautiful. This is a unisex fragrance. A man can wear this. Oh my God, I'm not. You don't focused. have to over spray it cause you can overdo it and give yourself a headache. It's something, it's a note in there that is like I don't know, it, it, it'll it'll play on just to try and smell. They always kind of introduce me to a lot of de designer. Oh my God, I don't look like I'm in focus. I'm not. I was supposed to be up closer. Shit. <laughs> I, that's why. That's why I hate this. That's why I hate my Canon because it's not no auto focus on it. So if I'm out of focus, I'm freaking shit out of luck. Damn it! Like if I was up a little closer. I love it. You may not like it. Y'all know about y'all little friend. Y'all watch. Oh my God. Okay. We just, whatever. We just gonna have to do it. We just gonna have to, just gonna have to upload it out of focus. It's really playing with the quality of my video. So I will say it. It's definitely playing with the quality because Hmm. Oh well. We gotta get the video up. Fragrance collection. It has expanded since the last video. So the last video I did was 2020 uh, perfume collection, and then I slid some additions I mean, in there. Uh, with well, smaller but videos but i have added to my perfume collection so however much it was two years ago it has i should have used this camera i it's it's uh i mean it's not like i'm not like hella out of focus but it's not giving hd it's giving 720 it's giving 1280 by 720 uh, perfume collection and then I slid some additions in there uh, with smaller videos but I have added to my perfume collection so however much it was two years ago it has well, definitely went up okay I most definitely need a longer coat mm-hmm mm -hmm. but we gonna make this shit twerk here I'm done editing. 
I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna put these Gucci boots on. They hurt my feet so much. Should have got like an inch and a half bigger. <sighs> I'm just about to throw these on and walk to the mailbox really quick. It's probably kind of dangerous. You probably should go in the morning. But my agent takes me and asks me, have I got this package? And apparently it's in the mailbox, I think. So I really need to text him back right like as soon as possible and I've been busy all day and ain't been able to respond and let him know that I did get the package. So we gotta, we gotta take a little hike in the snow to my mailbox while this video is uploading and um, hopefully by the time I get back, you know what, this is a 44 minute long video it's probably still gonna take it's probably still gonna take an hour to process so this video probably ain't gonna go up to like 11 o'clock at night and it's not gonna do well analytically going up that late but i already promised the blunt the brand that it would go up uh today and I'm just finishing it up right now, so you know it's nothing that I could do about that. It's nothing that I could do. She's so cute. So yeah. I am being sensitive, so why this dude I'm not okay, so Y'all know I'm, I'm I'm a new me, so to speak. And this dude that I used to be like really really cool with, he just texts, he just DM me, let me paint your walls. So, you know, I put a picture, I I put up a picture of me taking a picture in my in my bedroom. So like the walls is pretty bland. Like I only have like maybe two pieces of art up, and everything else like the walls are white. So I responded. I actually want to keep them white. He was talking nasty. First of all, sir, that's disrespectful. Who you think you DMing, first of all? Like, when, when you started talking to me like that? And he was like, oh my God, I can't believe you being so sensitive. Nigga, I ain't being sensitive. I'm grown as fuck. Who the fuck sends somebody some shit like that? Ain't nobody ever sent me nothing like that before. So how am I supposed to know you talking nasty? And, like... We're almost 40. Who still talks like that in their late 30s? Like, grow up. Let me paint your walls. Oh my God, y'all. It is so cold outside. Why is it so freaking cold? Like, it's cold. Hey, sir. Hey, sir. Hey, sir, what's the temperature? It's 21 degrees outside. Oh my, it, it show lives. Wow. Like, when I tell you I took off running, it wasn't, it was a light jog. It was a light jog because there's a lot of black ice on the ground and snow all down the alley where the garages are. And I don't stay close by the mailbox, but it's not a lot of townhouses over here. It's, it's a very intimate community. So I think, I want to say it's maybe 12 townhouses. Like this is a, a small community of 12 townhouses, but still, I'm like towards the end. So I had to take a, I had to make a little light jog plus my because it's so cold and it rained yesterday my mailbox was kind of uh frozen shut so i kind of hit like you know what i'm saying and i almost gave up and then it opened thank god because i'm pretty sure those products are frozen so they gotta thaw out maybe they'll be ready by tomorrow because they want this video up on the ninth and what's tomorrow tomorrow is the fourth so yeah we'll be able to make that deadline it is cold outside today. Whew. In the damn twenties. Mm. 
Wow. I am so oily right now. So I spray, um, y'all saw I spray dry shampoo on this hair last night. So now it's starting to tangle because I sprayed the dry shampoo on it. Because at first it was like, it was nice and oiled and hydrated and moisturized and whatnot. But it's not now because I put the dry shampoo on it. So now it's starting to tangle at the nape. But nothing a little serum can't fix. I'm just about to wrap my hair and take my makeup off and um, get in the shower. We had a nice productive day even though it started out late because I just really just didn't feel like working. <laughs> I'm just going to be honest. And I waited until the sun went down to want to start. And so I had to use the artificial lighting, the ring light and whatnot. And... If I was to choose, I like natural light better, but the video still came out really, really good. And I really like the aesthetics of filming that video in my bedroom. It's a really nice backdrop for, um, you know, those intimate videos where you're just talking to the camera like that. I think that that was a really good idea to film it up here instead of my office and i don't know if you guys can tell but the sound sounds so much better and it's because i got this video mic this rode mic from best buy this is the video mic go lightweight on camera microphone it's the rode mic um you can see what it looks like there highly recommend oh my god it's far and, and it, you can see that it's on top of a cannon like here in the picture you can see that it's on top of the cannon and i don't know what it is about the cannons that are before the 70ds but i have an old 60d camera and i just i just really don't want to replace it because i really don't do like sit down intimate videos like that where i'm talking to the camera anymore so like i don't really feel like i need to invest in a new dslr but with that specific camera that i have it has this hissing noise in the back so if you watch any of my previous fragrance videos you hear that hissing noise a lot and that mic removes it and i can actually like finagle the sound in final cut pro to like remove the hissing noise and it's like oh this mic i think was don't give me the line but i think it was a hundred dollars I don't know if I spent two hundred dollars on it because I really didn't want to spend a hundred dollars on it because you can get mics on Amazon for like twenty five dollars. But I'm telling you right right now, baby, those mics do not work on a Canon. They do not work on a Canon. Don't even don't even waste your money. I don't buy like three four mics off Amazon for like twenty five dollars a piece. They do not work on a Canon. Just go ahead and get this Rode mic. It's gonna save your life and your sound is gonna sound like literally a voiceover. And that's what you want it to sound like a voiceover. You don't want it to sound like you're like all the way in the other room yelling towards the mic because it don't sound good. And I hate that my previous fragrance videos, the, the sound quality is, is so terrible because I feel like those fragrance videos would have done so much better. But whatever. Whatever. Anyway, go watch that fragrance video. It's a good one. What's up, guys? Good morning. Good morning. Today is Monday. Oh, child. Today is Saturday. Today is Saturday, February 5th. It feel like a Monday because yesterday definitely felt like a Sunday. I'm so ready for the new power, though. So I'm glad today's Saturday because tomorrow's Sunday. That mean I get, I get to see what's popping because tomorrow is the season finale. I think. You know how they always skip a, 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 a week before the season finale? I, I hope they don't do that because... Ain't nobody got time for that, but I'm getting ready to go and um, get the Airbnb ready. It's pretty much ready. I just have to, like, open it um, for the guests because he's arriving at 3. I changed my check-in time from 2 to 3 because 
so yeah i'm gonna pop over there really quick and do that and then come back get this video ready to go up because i'm kind of pressed for time but let me show y'all what i got out because i'm about to do a little shop shop at home goods and and shop around for some stuff for the house okay so this is what i'm wearing today the jacket is from Jerly she and i just got on these i don't even think these are called ear mix these Nikes, these Air Nikes, the jeans are bodacious bodywear. They are literally the best jeans for a curvy girl. And then this um, bodysuit is from Shein. And I just have on my JBW watch per use. But yeah, this is today's fit. I don't have to clean, so I'm just opening it up and getting it ready. So I could be a little casual jazzy, you know? We're gonna have an eventful Saturday because today's Saturday. It feels like Monday. What kind of car y'all get? Why, why is it making that noise? Do you need a new muffler? I sound like I know what I'm talking about. Do you need a muffler? Y'all, the only thing that I hate about wearing lip gloss is that it get caught, my hair get caught in it and it make my hair oily. Baby, it's a red light. I don't know what you got going, but you gotta wait. You must not want your car. So we gonna have us a nice little eventful Saturday cause I keep thinking it's Monday cause yesterday felt like a Sunday. These snow days just throw just threw me all the way off. I really don't pay attention to like the dates in the days of the week until I'm editing and I have to put the day of the week in the video. But yesterday felt like a Sunday. It felt like a Sunday all through and through, honey. It was just a Sunday ass day. Lord forgive me. So yeah, we're gonna have us some we gonna do a little sun sun. We gonna we gonna find some stuff to do today. Cause yesterday I stayed in the house all day and I've been in the house for the past two three days. Snowed in, so baby, I need R and R. Okay. You don't touch me, somebody gonna touch me. You don't fuck me, somebody gonna fuck me. You don't love me, somebody gonna love me. Do do. Oh, he scared the shit out of me. Touch me, somebody gonna touch me. You don't fuck me, somebody gonna fuck me. You don't love me, somebody gonna love me. Do do. Why is it $130 a night? 
I cannot. I cannot. Child, they be trying to break the people out in the suburbs. Oh, that's cute. I guess I'm gonna have to go to the home store because I ain't paying eighty dollars for a fake plant. I am not. Okay, you guys, I am back at the house and oh, okay, I'm feeling weird. I'm feeling weird. So, I was just in a car accident, someone side swiped me. Um, I was trying to get over and this car wouldn't let me over so I had to slow all the way down and let them pass me so I can get over and get behind them. So when I did that, I don't know if the girl that sideswiped me wasn't paying attention and she was trying to get over in the lane as well. So she ended up like sideswiping me and breaking my side mirror and scratching up the front panel of my car. So. Yeah, we're gonna have to call Joe back over here to fix the car. Um, she had insurance and we switched information, but we didn't call the police and it didn't really dawn on me until after I had already drove off that in order for us to like, like file a claim on our insurance, it would have to be some sort of police report. So yeah, I don't know, but she does have insurance. She has some good insurance. Um, so we'll see how that works. Um, we'll see how much job. I mean, it's it's not that bad. It's definitely a buff in a paint job and a few dents that he's gonna have to pop out. But as far as like that mirror, I really don't know how the hell he gonna fix that mirror because it's only the plastic part that's around the mirror. It's not the actual mirror. But yeah, and. Um, I didn't put my mask on when I went at home goods. And now I'm feeling a little weird. I don't know, it's kind of feeling like how I was feeling around Christmas. But we shall see. Um anyway, yeah, um I'm super irritated right now. Like I'm so irritated because I have been back and forth with this particular uh, brand and um, we just can't come to an agreement on my video. Um, initially, I thought that I was agreeing to them only having to approve the sponsored portion of the video, but they want to approve and review my entire video. So with that being said, once I send them the link to my video and I'm like, okay, I'm ready for it to go live. You know, generally when a brand wants to review the video, it's just to review it. Like it's, I mean, it's still gonna go live. It's, it's approved. They just wanna see it before it goes live. Man, this brand hit me with like nine things they wanted me to take out of my video. Mind you, it's already been like hella hard to upload to YouTube this weekend. I don't know if it's, because of the snowstorm that's causing my internet speed to be low, but like the processing time on YouTube is just taking forever. Generally, it takes like an hour or two, but lately it's been taking like three, four hours longer than it, and a lot of times my uh, upload continues to fail consistently. So I've tried to upload this video eight times and only two of the times that i've uploaded it has it has actually successfully uploaded to youtube so with that being said like it's not really conducive right now because of what's going on with whatever it is i don't know if it's my youtube speed i mean my internet speed youtube processing i don't know but right now it's just not conducive to like keep going back and forth with all these different edits like Tell me the first time when I send the video, what needs to be taken out. And I've already removed like 10 minutes of footage because the agency was like, okay, the brand isn't gonna like this in the video, the brand isn't gonna like this. So I can't talk about Zara, I can't talk about Shein, I can't talk about my hair products. I can't mention any brand and I'm like, 
as an influencer, part of my blog and job encompasses talking about the things that I use, where, you know, where I shop and things like that. So you're asking me not to do any of this in an hour long vlog. And I generally do this in each and every one of my blogs. It's like so difficult. Like that is like, that is asking a lot, right? So um, now I'm at the point where I just really want to pull out of the campaign and just say, I don't think that it's gonna be a good fit for me and this brand to work together because I can't, I, like you're, you're asking for a dedicated video, so to speak. Like you're asking me to do a dedicated video where I'm not talking about anything else but this brand. And if you're gonna ask for a dedicated video, you need to pay a dedicated video price, but I don't even do dedicated videos. So if you're asking me for a mention in a vlog, you have to understand that there are gonna be other things mentioned in the vlog. And I think that that's just so unfair to ask of me and you know that I'm doing an hour long vlog. Like, so I'm like super, super irritated right now. I'm just, I'm just hoping I'm not seeing. I'm just hoping this one time that I went out without my mask is not gone. Oh, God.